Is your Windows 11 PC moving slower than a sleepy sloth in summer? Instantly give it a pick me up with these simple tips. This is DIY in five. Hey everyone, welcome to DIY in five. The show where we make tech simple enough you can do it yourself in a quick, easily digestible video. Today, we're going over easy ways to speed up your Windows 11 PC. Whether you've got an older laptop that needs a pick me up, or you're troubleshooting a new laptop that just isn't performing as it should. These quick tricks should get you up to speed. First, make sure Windows 11 is fully updated. I know, I get hesitant about updates breaking more than they fix too. But considering Windows updates are usually packed with performance, security, and bug fixes, it's a good first step when troubleshooting PC issues. Second, let's get rid of apps you don't need. Before restarting, head to Settings, App, Startup, sort everything by startup impact, and go through and toggle off any apps you don't need started. Then it's time to restart your PC and only open the apps you need. This will prevent apps, programs, web browsers, etc. from running in the background and slowing down your PC. In fact, while we're at it, why not go into your settings, look at installed apps, and uninstall anything extra there you don't need. Be gone, bloatware! Speaking of things running in the background and slowing down your PC, let's talk about OneDrive for a moment. Windows 11 and OneDrive are in a symbiotic relationship at this point. It's hard to differentiate one from the other. And OneDrive syncing can really strain your system if you let it. Good news is you can pause or resume syncing or even turn it off altogether in OneDrive settings. Windows 11 has other settings we can toggle to see a quick boost as well. By turning off visual effects like transparency and animations, you can save some precious resources. You can also toggle your PC to performance mode by going to settings, system, power and battery, and choosing best performance as your power mode. Perhaps it's your browser that's seeming sluggish. There are browser settings that allow you to optimize performance while browsing and beyond. By updating your browser, deleting any unwanted extensions, and in Chrome specifically, you can turn on the Memory Saver feature, freeing up memory from inactive tabs. Try upgrading to an NVMe SSD from a SATA SSD or HDD. Unlike traditional hard drives and even SATA SSDs, NVMe drives connect directly to your motherboard via the PCIe interface. This allows for data transfer speeds that can be up to 14 times faster than SATA SSDs and over 20 times faster than HDDs. What does that mean for you? Faster boot times, quicker file transfers, and an overall snappier system. Finally, it could be a lack of storage that's slowing you down. Backup files to another destination like an external SSD or the cloud or even both, then free up room on the PC's internal storage drives. Hopefully one of these tips helped you out, and if so, please like this video and share it with a friend who also has a PC that needs a speed boost. Subscribe to the channel while you're at it, and I will see you next time with more DIY in 5.